Hey guys, how's it going? It's Hyde here, and we're back with a brand new episode of Revive and Prosper. And since the last episode, I've done a little bit of stuff. We have set up some sprinklers here. The pipes are not done yet. Let me show you. It's a work in progress. So we've gone ahead. I've set this thing up. I don't know if we need this every time or not, but it was the only way I was able to make it work last time. So I've gone ahead and added another one of these. We've got our deep water pump here the dam is still a work in progress we're kind of a little bit short on trees right now so i might actually use this area over here to start growing some more trees really quickly but where we're at we got the pump this is all working that's all working we're going down and this area down here is actually starting to get watered briefly every once in a while um, it's because we don't have enough power just yet, so I might have to go ahead and upgrade this as well. I just don't have a lot of wood. You know what? Let's not do this right now. Because I don't have wood to use for that. Oh, and I definitely don't want to mess up my torque rods. Okay, we'll leave that going. I've gone ahead over here and I've set up a extra coal extractor, which is not done yet because we don't have any wood but right now the governing thing or what's taking so long is getting coal into here because the pipes actually take coal as well and well we're splitting the coal so many ways right now that it's just not getting very much so i want to get more coal in here we're gonna work on that it's gonna allow us to get more pipes as soon as we get enough wood to build this area up I think it's going to be a huge, huge bump to our production because the water is going to go up high enough to come over here and then this whole area should be irrigated and we'll be able to plant a pile more trees. It's just right now we're kind of limited. Like, I mean, these things are not producing that much wood for us right now, so it's kind of bad, but it is what it is. I'm just going to chop these trees. I know it's only two. It's only two wood right now, but... I mean, we need wood. So this one's up to three now. Let's chop that down. We just need a few more. We just got to get this over the edge. We're so close. Oh my gosh, we're so close. I can almost taste the wood. Okay, and we also have to start worrying about trains. Now, I don't know exactly how these things are going to work. Mechanical rail. Mechanical rail. Is that the same as a train rail? I imagine it probably is. It's strange to me that this whole mission is about trains, but then you don't really need to do anything with trains except for deliver stuff. But we could deliver it any way we want. So anyway, we're going to play around with it. Rail Depot, Resource Depot, Liquid Depot. Let's see, what does this look like? Resource Depot? Okay. So I think we're going to want one of these somewhere over here. How big is this? I don't want to... I don't want to cover up the area that we could be using for irrigated soil. So we're just going to, I don't know, do something like that. We're going to need one of these over here as well, I suppose, because it's going to have to extract items. Are these automated? They must be, right? Mechanical components, they must be automated. Let's go ahead and build this up a little a little bit okay we can put some we can put some stairs in here so that we can actually get up there and then i'm gonna have to build some sort of a bridge to get across with the actual train as well so i guess let's just keep building this up let's go too wide maybe that'll help let's go too wide oh my god we've done it Oh crap, I gotta dig lower. I gotta dig. Oh, we've done it. Okay, we have irrigation, at least some form of it. Now this, do I want this to overflow? I think I do after a while. Let's make sure it gets really full before it overflows though. All right, that should be good. That should be good. So we're going to be able to start planting trees around the outside of this area very soon, which is going to be very good because we are going to need way more wood than what we're currently producing. 
So let's just go ahead and get this set up. I need lots and lots and lots of wood and we currently do not have enough. All right, well, that looks like it's gonna work out pretty good for us. Ooh, I might have to lower this a bit though or we're gonna end up with a problem. Just a, just a touch. I don't want this to overflow. Okay, this thing is now working. We are producing 169 power from that guy. I could probably actually get a second one set up somewhere. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We don't want to flood. We don't want to flood. Go down, go down, go down, go down, go down, go down, go down. A little bit more. I don't want to smother all my trees. Okay. That looks like it's going to work out for us quite nicely. Now, what I'm going to have to do is set all of these to be automatic cut and replant and we want all of these and all of these and all of these basically all of these trees perfect we'll do all of them like so now what i can do i think is we'll just cut these trees down and we won't replant them automatic cut down and do not replant okay we don't we shouldn't need any of these trees anymore That'll give us a little bit more wood for the time being. Okay, and it looks like we still have too much water coming through. We're gonna have to lower that a little bit. Bad things are gonna happen. Okay, that looks good. That looks really good. We've got water, we're making power. We've got some sprinklers set up. Okay, we can probably start setting up a farm here really soon. I do need more wind power though. I should have left a little bit more room for water wheels, but whatever. It is what it is. Let's just slap down a whole pile more of these guys for now. And hopefully that's enough to keep this thing juiced out. Now, while that is all happening, oh, we're flooding again. Oh, we're flooding again. Oh, we're flooding again. Hang on. Lower, 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 lower. There's a lot of water coming through this area. <laughs> there is a lot of water. Okay, I think that is good enough for now. So while that's happening, like I was trying to say, we can start planting some crops. Now we need 200 carrots, so we may as well just get started with the carrots, I suppose. Not sure exactly what this is. Can't build on uneven terrain. Okay, I think that's all fine and well. Carrots are going to be there. I should probably even out all of this stuff. Because then we'll be able to use... We'll be able to use that area as well. Okay, we got carrots. We're going to need cabbage. Where is cabbage? Cabbage. We'll put that in here. And what else do we need? Carrots cabbage, corn, and onion. Can I do this or is it going to get all mad? It's going to get all mad. Okay, carrots, cabbage, corn, 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 and onion. We'll do something like that. Once this sprinkler actually starts to work, I think we're going to be okay. We're going to want to auto harvest automatic cut down and replant these are already set to do that right yep okay looks good now why is this one here not getting water but those ones over there are it's kind of weird open you think it would be working maybe there's not enough Pump power still. What do we got here? We're still missing some torque. Okay, so we're gonna need this quickly. I should probably turn these back on. Wooden mechanisms. I had turned it off briefly just so that our wood was getting turned into dam components, but now we should be fine to start making those again. Look at how lush everything is over here. Ooh, it's so green. All right, we're going to have so much wood right away. That is terrific. You'll love to see that. Now, we are going to need... Well, maybe not. I want this to be level. We're going to want that to be level. Then we're going to need a train track. 
I don't know how this works. But we could start... We could start setting it up. Can we go up and down on these things? Rail depot. How do we go up and down? Rail up. We can only go up? Can't go down? Or I guess maybe it works both ways. Like that. Okay. We want to go across in a little corner. Uh-oh. 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 Oh, no. These things have like a minimum turning radius, which is going to really screw me up. Okay, uh, we're going to have to destroy all this for a moment. This is this is not going to be pretty. I didn't realize it was so wide of a turn. Okay, we're going to need something like that. We're going to need something like that. Then we're going to need something like this okay <laughs> okay that should work for us i think it's gonna work we're gonna go like this this one's gonna want to go up here in a moment we need some room okay let's go up with the terrain and i'm gonna have to go up with that terrain too let's just delete this thing get that out of the way go up with the terrain We'll have to go up in there as well but that's going to be good for now so we're going to want to go up with the train up and then we're going to want to go up one more time once that's done and then we should be in line i don't know how the like turning around and stuff is going to work i might need like i might need to make a loop in here which is not the best because it doesn't i don't really have any room but we'll have to see if I need to make a loop, we could probably get something like this to work, but then I'm going to need a merger or something in here. I, I don't know exactly how this is going to work yet. All right, guys, so I've been playing around with this and we've almost got our train all the way across. Now, I don't know if we have to make a train pickup machine, pickup machine. Oh, here we go. Transport train. What the heck? Must be placed on a straight line. Okay, let's put this down. How do I use this? I don't know how to use this thing. Maybe, I, maybe we'll figure it out once it gets built, maybe. So we'll get that going. I gotta make sure this doesn't overflow. Alright, and I have gone ahead and started connecting all of my... All of my power sources together with these torque rods I'm hoping that's gonna make things a little bit better I noticed that the train actually requires power as well and the pump wasn't getting enough power before so hopefully now this is going to help with the sprinkler situation once everything actually gets connected I'm hoping it's gonna be fine Okay, we're all the way to here. Now, what I could do just to get the power to actually work is I could just stick a vertical post right there and then we're already locked in. Everything should be going. The sprinklers are not keeping up fully with our watering requirements yet, but I'm hoping once we get full power to this thing, it'll be going a little bit better. Now the train, oh my God, the train is going bounce road end bounce oh my god okay so it doesn't even have to i don't need a loop which is good i guess wait another train wait why do we have birch seeds in here <laughs> excuse me um no 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 we don't want birch seeds we want carrots for now let's put carrots in here and we'll just delete all these birch seeds out of here, maybe? How do I get them out? Okay, and then here we want to load to machine at this location. And we want to unload at this location. Unload from machine. Wooden mechanisms. Why are those in there? Those shouldn't... 
those shouldn't be in there. Um, yeah, those definitely shouldn't be in there. I'm not sure what's going on. Anyway, I'm hoping we're going to have enough belts for all this or tracks. Where are my tracks? We still have 47 left. That's only going to take one, three, a couple more pieces of one. All right, we, sh we should be close. I think we're going to be close. Network is missing 1,064 torque. That's not good. Oh, that is really not good. Time to start spamming windmills. Let's go. We need power. <laughs> 1,064 torque. What the heck is that? What am I supposed to do with that? See, the problem with this thing is it looks like it's just stuck on birch seeds right now and I can't get it to get off of there. That's the output. Load to machine. Unload from machine. I don't think that's changing anything i need to somehow get this to be set up to carrots and i don't know if i have to just break it and start a new one might have to just break it and start a new one let's oh it looks like you can put stuff in the sides okay hang on what if i set this to be carrots put that there do this there should be power yeah we've got a pile of extra power now and then once that's done, I can maybe force carrots into there. Where are my carrots getting stored right now? I don't... I don't have any carrots. That's weird, right? I haven't delivered any yet, have I? No. Hmm... I'm not sure what's going on. I also just realized we're probably going to need some kind of some kind of way to deal with the water because we're gonna have no water soon and i i really don't want all my crops to die all right guys i think we got this thing set up here we got carrots in it perfect this thing has carrots in it now it is gonna go and hopefully drop the carrots off over there oh it's not gonna get there yet it's not going to get there yet. We got to make sure these things are urgent. Very, very urgent. We need at least to get to here. Right there. And then this, once it's connected, should. I think the train actually transports power. I think it does. So we'll have to see what happens there. Ay, ay, ay. My sprinkler systems, they keep running out of juice. I need more windmills, but uh, unfortunately, it kind of just is what it is for now. I wonder if I could sneak in a couple more water wheels. You know, we just sneak them in here. Why won't it let me build in there? Occupied by Willow. What if I build in here? I mean, that'll probably be better than nothing. Although, you know what? I can't even get... I can't connect that thing to power anywhere. Everything's so far away. I think I just need more water wheels. I mean, more windmills. And right now, we are overproducing by a pile. So why is this not working? It should be working. Might just take a minute for the lines to get full of water again. I'm not sure why the sprinklers aren't aren't always working but it is what it is i don't know we're hopefully we're getting somewhere the carrots are going to be getting delivered soon i started setting up all these other ones here so that i could have more than one more than one machine going and i don't know if that's really a good thing or a bad thing or what the situation is but because we're only going to have one spot here to drop resources off from, even though I'm going to have four to take it over there, which is kind of a problem. But once we get the items in, 
then they can sit there and I can just wait until I've got the 200 carats done and then we can switch it to something else. But this should... No, 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 no. I don't want those in there. Listen, I don't want those in there. There we go. We got carrots. Okay, destroy that. Destroy that. All right, we're starting to deliver carrots. Slow and steady. Now, the problem is we're not making any more carrots because we have no water over here and I don't know why. Oh man, I don't know what is going on. I'm not sure why we're not getting water. We got we got power to our pump. Yeah, we should be good. Even this, this pipe has water all the way to it. Open? I don't know. This pipe is full. I don't know why it won't come out. <laughs> please, please just come out. All right, guys, so I've gone ahead and started setting up more water wheels over here. I'm thinking this is going to help a little bit. I could maybe get another one in over there, but I don't know if it's worth it. I actually could probably get some in on this side. Oh, I could probably get some on this side. Cut and do not replant. Let's harvest these trees, get them out of the way, and then I might be able to sneak in a couple extra water wheels on this side. This is going to help out a lot, I think. How are we looking? Perfect. Another 200 torque there. This one will be a bunch here soon as well. That should help. I think this is going to help our our problem. I think what's going on here is these things hold 64 and what's happening when I finally actually do end up with enough power or enough yeah enough power to pump stuff it starts filling some of them up but it doesn't fill them all up equally although this one has 52 in it and it's just not on so there goes that idea unless it has to be full before it'll work Maybe it has to be full before it'll work. Oh, it's starting to work now. Or maybe not. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Anyway, I think for the first thing we have to worry about is just making sure this thing has power all of the time. I'm hoping. And then once that has power all the time, we should hopefully be good to go. We'll have to see. Okay, my sprinklers are finally starting to work, and I think it's because we actually are producing enough power here now. We got 1,000 left over. We're still going to go down a little bit more, but I mean, things are looking good. Let's get this thing set up here. Full speed ahead. That is a lot of water wheels, but I think it's what we needed. So that should be good once that's all done. We've got a pile of wood stored up. Our crops are starting to get grown again. And I'm just waiting for these mechanisms, metal mechanisms, metal mechanisms. I guess I got to pull these things out of here so they can actually reach them. Let's go put these into storage, I suppose. That should fix it, I think. Once it's built, let's get that going really quickly here and then once that's going we should be able to get access to the metal mechanisms which should allow all this to start up now we're we're almost halfway done the onions here i did swap it out to onions because my carrots weren't working properly but now with the sprinkler well it's empty again so i don't know what's going on maybe one pump can't do that many sprinklers maybe one pump can just only do one sprinkler or like one full time or two part time. I don't, I don't know. I wonder if I should just get rid of this one. And once we're done with onions, I can just swap the onions out. Maybe that might be better, perhaps. I don't know. I guess it doesn't hurt anything for now. We'll just leave it. It seems to be working. See, every once in a while, this thing gets plugged up like it's full of water. Water height. 
We have extra power. So, it, I don't know. It's just not pumping the water fast enough. Even though all the pipes are full. It's very strange. Like, this pipe right here is full. But this thing right here has none in it. So, I, I don't know. Anyway, it doesn't matter a whole bunch. We're kind of just waiting now for the crops to finish. And for these things to finish. Is this thing done? Okay, let's put mechanisms in there. Okay, that should allow our guys to grab them and start using them. And then basically all I have to do is get all these storages full of vegetables. And then just keep hauling it over there until it's done. I mean, it is what it is at this point. That's kind of where we're at. So, I'm going to let this finish. We'll see what happens. Hopefully it doesn't take too long for all that to finish up, but it's probably going to take a while. Got a lot of growing to do. But once I'm done building stuff and all I have to do is grow, then I could probably set this crop area here to be high priority and just get them to focus all their attention on it. I got one idea and it might work. It might ruin everything. I'm going to break this really quickly and we're going to try and put a storage tank in and I'm, I might even be able to connect these things together. Let's set this to super high priority so that these guys focus on it. I don't want to dry up all of these things, but once this is done, maybe we're just... Maybe we just need to store more water or something? I don't know. See, this thing here is empty now. I guess that makes sense. I've, un I've unhooked the pipe. So, once this is fixed up, hopefully everything just goes back to normal, but... I mean, we'll see how it goes. All of these are done in here. For the most part. We got one of these storages for all of the resources, so we're going to just go ahead and keep farming that stuff up. And how are we doing as far as onions? We're down to 99 onions remaining, so that's not so bad. We're getting close. Feels pretty good. We just got to keep it up and see if this thing actually works the way we want it to. Of course, they started... Why would they start with this one? They had this one as top priority. <laughs> I had this one as top priority. Why are they doing this one first? This liquid container leaks its liquid over time onto the ground. Okay, I don't really care about all that. But I do want you guys to finish this thing, please. Okay. So that should be working. We got a water height of 24. This thing can do 31. So it should start to put water in here. Can hold 100. I don't know if that's going to help or not. This thing should be starting to get some water here shortly. I don't know where it's going. Okay, now for some reason, this one has started again. I have no idea what's going on with the sprinklers. It makes no sense to me. But it doesn't matter. We don't care too much. I'm still trying to just get onions. Onions, onions, onions. Are these onions? Yeah, they are. Okay, let's set this field over here to be top priority for our little buddies here. If you can harvest or do something here, then you are going to do it. That is your number one goal at this point. Nothing else matters. Now, I just realized my corn is not being planted because they can't find any corn. And then I looked over here. There's some corn right here that we can grab. I gotta make sure they don't accidentally put it in there. Um, and then there's also corn over here, but we've got no way to get up over there right now. So we're going to need to build some stairs, I guess. We will build some stairs here and I guess here we can even that out. I can dig this out. They should be able to get up there after that's done, hopefully. These guys are doing their thing. What's all this stuff in here? Cabbage seeds? There's just a pile of items. Oh crap, they're delivering stuff by hand. I don't want them to do that. Because they might end up delivering all my corn. And that would be bad. Alright, no one is delivering corn. Please. Plant. Let's go. Oh my god, everything is wet all of a sudden. Is it the water situation the whole time? 
I might not have just I maybe just didn't have enough water. I don't know. It's all wet again, so That's good. I don't really understand, but I will accept All right guys, so we're almost there we're getting closer still have no idea what's going on with the sprinklers I've been playing around with it trying to get it to work a little bit better I even added a second pump up here thinking I wasn't hauling enough water and it just doesn't seem to be helping. So I completely deleted this one in the middle. We didn't need it anymore. Because I already maxed out whatever it was. Cabbage? I already maxed out cabbage. So we don't need any more of that. So I deleted it entirely. Added a second pump. I even got rid of that check valve thingy. Just to see if that would fix the problem. And it's not. It, I mean, it's maybe a little bit working we got some water here it seems to be checking out okay i don't know if these carrots are actually growing or not but anyway we're getting super close i have gone ahead and as you can see here upgraded some of these belts to metal belts that are much faster so it makes this a lot nicer we're just piling down the numbers here we're getting super duper close but i think guys all I have to do is just wait for this to finish, so there's no point in uh, waiting and extending this episode any longer than it has to go. I mean, we've basically beat it. I just got to wait it out here. So I'm even going to go ahead and let this run for a bit. I think these guys are going to be able to pull it off without me even touching anything at this point. But uh, we'll see how it goes. In the next one, I guess we're going to try a new mission. I don't know which one we're going to do yet. We'll have to take a look together. But guys, I hope you're liking the series so far. If you are, don't forget to leave me a thumbs up on this video. Subscribe to my channel if you're new here. And I will see you next time.